everyone, I'm Julie. Welcome to Big Sky Beauty. Um, let's get on with Saturday's smileys today. I've got a few things for you and one stinker. It's one, but it's three. We'll get to that. Okay, um, let me see. First of all, I want to show you this little gadget that I picked up at Walmart. Now, I saw somebody showing one of these in a video a while back. I think it might have been Angie over at Hot and Flashy, um, but now they have them at Walmart, and I had never seen them there before. They're, they're new at Walmart. They're, uh, what is it called? A beauty spoon. And it's got this silicone little thing at the end. Uh, genius. Absolutely genius. I'm trying to find something that'll work. Uh, when your bottles get empty, you just, you know, you got a whole bunch in there and I'll sit here for, uh, uh, uh. Or, I have seen this done a lot and I do this myself, cutting the things in half and digging out what's left. Well, with this little beauty spoon, you can just... A dig right down in there and this little thing will fold up so you can get it down in your holes fantastic I am super happy with it and I've been using the crap out of this thing believe it or not for more things than just digging product out of jars yeah not nothing weird <laughs> really Julie what would that be really cool little product though I'm loving it and I just stumbled on that okay I have been wearing the polish that you see on my nails um, when I put this on the other day, I thought, oh, that looks really nice. And I've kept it on. I've liked it so much. I also, God, my husband's a creeper. <laughs> For almost a week now. And look at that. Not a chip. I do use Sesh Vite over the top. But still, I mean, I just, it's wearing beautifully. It's from the Orly brand. I'm sure we all know that brand. And uh, this one is called Boho Bonnet. And it's just a beautiful periwinkle, basically, is what it is. Just a gorgeous nail polish. And I got this in the clearance bin at Ulta for $4 or $5.99, I think. So I've been really happy with that. I wish I would have gotten several of them. They had several different colors. And I didn't. I just got the one, and I wish I would have got the other ones. Same Holt Look Haul. Holt Look Haul. I purchased these three things right here. And one is the Bahama Mama. I'm sure you have all seen it. It is new to me, though. And I have been using this for contouring. And it's just the, you know, the Bahama Mama. Like I said, I'm pretty sure you've all seen it. I've been loving that. It's a good contour. But these two blushes that I picked up. And I tell you, I would have got the other ones, too, but they were all gone by the time I got there. <laughs> Somebody else had snagged them up. I got the two in stains. One is in pinstripe and one is in toile. Loving these. I have worn nothing on my cheeks all week except these two blushes. And they're powder. And you guys know I'm liking my cream. So this is kind of saying something. Here's the toile. And it's just a beautiful, beautiful... Um, it, it's almost got a touch of coral in it. But it's more of a deep pink. I, it's, it's just gorgeous. And I can't believe that I went my whole life in this business and never tried these blushes. These things do not move off your face. You, they stay right where you put them. And for the younger girls, they like to have prom or something like that. These are going to work fantastic. Um, I had a couple girls. I did a wedding this morning, and I had a couple girls ask for these specifically. I have them in my train cage, you know, because they're nice and compact, and I just love them. I love the packaging, and you get quite a bit of product, too, for, you know, for what you get. You get 7 grams, 6.5 grams of product, which is, a you know, it's a considerable amount. And then the pinstripe one is a beautiful, beautiful mauve. Um, I love this so much because it is like my Fantastico mauve, mauve of Milani's but without the shimmer. Okay, look at this beautiful color. Oh, oh my gosh, I just love it. Look at that. And it's gorgeous. I mean, it's this is this is like my my skin tone blush, you know? And then I'm going to swatch the Milani and put it next to it just so you can see the difference. Oh, there's quite a bit of difference actually now that you look at it <laughs> side by side. The Milani's quite a bit more pinker, but yeah, just really, really been liking these in stains from the bomb. And I now must have the rest. <laughs> because I just need to. I love the packaging. I love it. It's so compact and 
and tidy, you know, and they stack nice and neat in my train case, and I just love it. I love, love, love them. Okay, now, and this is kind of a no-brainer, I'm sure, but the IT Cosmetics Number 50 Serum was recently on sale uh, for Beauty, or for um, Ulta's 21 Days of Beauty. $20, you guys, this was on sale for, and it's normally $48. It rarely goes on sale. This is such a gorgeous product. I'm not going to talk too much about it because I have a huge IT video coming up, and I'm going to have um, a bunch of different products, brushes, a bunch of different brushes that I have from the line. Um, I'm going to give a, a rundown of Jamie Kern Lima. And, you know, she used to be, uh, she was Miss Washington, and she was like in the running for Miss USA. And it's just, it's a pretty neat story. And, you know, it's kind of a rags to riches story, and I like that. But she had a vision, and she made something of it. And I tell you, this is just a gorgeous, gorgeous product. I will put this on my face in the mornings after I wash and everything, you know, to prime. I don't even use my moisturizer during the day with this. Um, I will put on one of my serums, like my my Argon serum or my Hyaluronic serum, you know, just a thin serum, and then I'll put this over the top of it, and it's really all I need. Now, I can't say that that would be the case with maybe really dry skin because I have oily skin, so I don't really need a whole lot of moisturizer. But this is so beautiful, I just put it over the top of whatever, you know, light serum I have on. The only problem places that I really have are under my eyes, and so... I will put that under my eyes as well, and then I will take the Feel the Moment Serum and take the tiniest drop, and I'll put it under both eyes and rub that in, and I'll give that about five minutes to set in, and my makeup is absolutely flawless. I stay hydrated all day. It stays where I put it. It looks nice and fresh by the end of the day. I swear I don't think that I could live without these two products. Now that I have discovered them, I, I feel like I would panic if I didn't have them. And I don't have to worry about that because I've got um, three backs up, backups of each. <laughs> um, I did a wedding this morning and most of the bridal party wanted this palette. And I just, it's beautiful. I don't use it that much just because it is so sparkly. Did you just see that? I just totally had a goss moment, didn't I? <laughs> Except it's, it's crown brush instead of Chanel. Wow. So I just had that product fall out of the pan. Nice. Well, it looks like I better glue those back in. That was totally a Wayne Goss move. Did you ever see that one where he's comparing the Chanel cream shadows to the elves? And he lift that one up and the Chanel pot just, everything fell right out onto the ground. <laughs> just, and he's like, that did not just happen. Well, it just happened to me too, Wayne. <laughs> so... Anyways, this is the Blizzard palette from Crown Brush, and I got this on Holt Look when Crown Brush was there. Uh, it was the same time that I got those br those 17 brushes I got, and a couple of them shed like beast. And they have quit, by the way. Love them. But I got this palette when I was there, and look at those gorgeous colors, you guys. Just look at them. I didn't realize that there was zero matte in this palette, but, you know, I have enough matte shadows. I'm okay with that, because let me show you. Let me do a couple swatches on this. It is just absolutely stunning. And for you younger gals out there that, you know, can pull off these kind of looks. Let's see. Let's go for a gray one. They're all super creamy. They're almost, they're almost cream shadows. They're so beautiful. Creamy like infallibles. Look at that color. It's absolutely gorgeous. I'm so glad that I got it. It's normally, I believe, on the um, crown brush side, it's normally like... Um, Maybe $35 or something? Don't quote me on that. I'm not sure. But I got it for, I think, like 20 bucks. Oh, look at those. Petty. Petty, petty. Color. It's The pigmentation in these is outstanding, and I'm really happy that I picked it up. This is the closest thing that I own to, like, a 88 palette or something, you know, like that. I don't have... I don't have any use for those great big palettes. I can't really do anything with them. They're just big space takers. They're messy, you know, they're they're inconvenient for me. And this is the biggest one that I have, and I love it. Well, no, I got that Smashbox one that's the Wonder Vision one. That one's pretty big, too. Okay, and then I got um, a couple of these off of QVC. They come in a kit of two for $35. And this is called the Nick Chavez Dry Volumizing Flocker. This is a wonderful product for, 
you know, you're getting towards the middle of the day. Now, I've got these plumping products that when I get done blowing my hair, I just look like freaking Medusa. And I love it. <laughs> yeah, and I never, I never look like that, you know. I, I have products that make my hair look like Tammy over it. You know, over up these beads for a couple hours, and then it, you know, blah, kind of goes down. But this stuff here, you just shake it up really good, lift your hair up a little bit, you know, lift it up like this on the sides, and spray a little bit in there, and just go like that until it dries. It's a, it's a dry flocker. You use it while it's dry, and poof, boom. There's all this. I carry one of these in my bag. I do. I have one for home and one for in my bag. Gorgeous, gorgeous product. I absolutely love it. It's uh, probably the best middle of the day refresher for your hair that I've ever found. It's beautiful. I don't have any alcohol in it. I remember seeing on the on the thing that, but it does have parabens, and it also has um, hydrofluorocarbon, which a lot of people are anal about that because that's the ozone killer. But you know, okay. Um, final thing for my loves this week. My IT brushes. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys, I cannot tell you enough about these gorgeous, gorgeous brushes. Um, this, I'm not going to say talk too much about them because I do have, I'm going to be showing these in that big IT video I have coming up. Um, this is the one that really got me going on this set. This came with my Celebration Foundation, the illuminating one. Uh, that was not a hair out of the brush. That was... Uh, this came with that, and I just loved it so much. It looks so classy. It's got the name, IT Cosmetics name on it right there. And, of course, it's just a superior performing brush. I, I absolutely love this brush. I don't use hardly any other of the three dozen flat tops <laughs> buffers that I have. I've got three of these ones, and they are my go-to buffers. Well, I just had to order these because they match, for one. Plus, you know, I, I just had to. I had to do it. Uh, gorgeous, gorgeous brushes. Now, there are some beautiful details about these brushes, like the little rhinestone on the bottom. Um, I'm going to tell you all about these, as well as the Lux brushes. Now, I've got a couple more coming in the mail right now with the order that I have coming, um, which is the, the reason why I haven't put the IT video up yet, because I'm waiting for that order to come in. But these brushes here will run you $48 a piece. And they're all Lux. She calls them all the Lux line. So I think these are just like the special edition, you know, with the um, chrome handles. But they're all Lux brushes. But um, these ones here, you know, have got the classic, um, classic, you know, Sigma look to them, I guess. But it's got that rubberized handle. Love, love, love these brushes. I... You know, I know that I sound repetitive and silly sitting here saying over and over, I love, 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 but I do. I don't have any more words that properly, you know, besides, oh my God, I love, I just, these are fantastic brushes. And if you are ever ordering any IT items, your best bet is to go to QVC because the chances are they will probably have what you want there and it comes with a brush for ten fifteen dollars more than what it would cost you know for the single item on QV or on IT cosmetics site so if you go to QVC to order the same thing pay another ten fifteen dollars and you get a brush with it which these are fifty eight or forty eight dollars on the IT site and they never ever ever go on sale the IT site just got off of their twenty five percent off of friends and family sale and boy did I hit that hard <laughs> make sure my husband didn't hear that um so that is all for my faves and i will be talking about these in my upcoming video now for my stinker and i am sorry anastasia because i love your products i think that they are very very good products very long lasting very um you know perfect for professionals uh, i've been using anastasia for a long time and i've never been dissatisfied with anything until these and these are the hair the hair chalks that she has out, um, hypercolor, hypercolor hair chalks. I've got ultraviolet, red luscious, and um, Lola lilac. And what you do with these, let me show you. Okay, these are meant for your hair. And I got these just to have in my kit, just because 
I do a lot of younger girls, and they like this kind of stuff. So why not, why not score brownie, brownie points by saying, "Hey, look, I've got some, I got some hair chalk." You know, I mean, it's just a good thing to have. What you do is you take a piece of your hair. Say, I'll take one of these down here. Take a piece of your hair, and you just put your finger on it like this. You know, just like if you're gonna, I don't know, roll it up or something. I'm not sure, but, and then you just run the chalk over it like this. Okay, and then you turn it around and do it on the opposite end. And then your hair has got this chalk on it. And it actually has fantastic coverage. So for any of you out there that like this kind of thing, this is this got really, really good coverage. The only problem is, unless you spray something on it, like um, a setting spray for your makeup or a hairspray or something, it transfers off onto everything. Look at this. Well, you're not going to be able to see that. Yeah, you can. Look, if I just rub my hair up against my face, you see that? Um, and the red is even worse. <laughs> and so, yeah, I just love them. And the color is absolutely gorgeous. Look at those colors. There's got to be something more with it. Maybe come up with a, some kind of a spray that you can use to set the color on there until you wash it out so that it doesn't transfer on every. These products here, while... The color is fantastic. The ease of use is great. The concept is great. It washes right out. But the, there needs to be something to go with these to set it on your hair, you know, to seal the color onto your hair shaft so that it doesn't wipe off onto everything. <laughs> Messing up my hours and hours of makeup on them girls. Okay, that is it, you guys. As it is, I'm going to have to edit this down by about 20 freaking minutes. Um, I love you all so much. Thank you for watching. I cannot tell you my appreciation. And um, we will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.